hey guys welcome to my youtube channel um, this video I'm going to show you how to draw support and resistance levels using your smartphones only no laptops involved no other device like just your smartphones you can literally draw your support and resistance and trade and make money off of it as I speak to you I'm in a trade right now running three thousand dollars and I'm doing this over the weekend the markets are closed so uh, I'll close this position once the market reopen um, okay back to what I was saying this is how you draw your support and resistance straight to the point support is a level where the market has bounced off more than two times in the past and people are buying from that zone meaning here is support the market has bounced once then the second time then the third time this is where you want to buy this is where you are entering because you know that it is support why is it support because it has bounced twice in the past then if that level breaks that level becomes resistance if that level breaks that level becomes resistance you want to sell from that level when the market pulls back in to pick up more orders then this is where you want to enter and take the market down to the previous lows so let's identify another support level by the way i use the four hour um i use the four hour time frame to get uh, the most obvious levels where market has uh, you know four hours has a lot of volume that's a, a lot of uh, volume that's that's a lot of time that the, the price has made in that particular uh, 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 area so here we have we can identify that here this is support because the market has bounced more than twice and the third time is where you want to enter your buy order first time second time third time you buy and you take it up it's just like that it's just like that then how do you know it's time to buy you wait for an engulfing bullish candle then for sale, you wait for an engulfing bearish candle. I mean, you should know candles, candle patterns. If you don't know, you should check out other uh, YouTube videos. I'll make a video on that shortly. So you should subscribe so I keep dropping videos and you watch. So this is how you use your phone to draw these levels. Then you go on the one hour to execute your trade. So here, this is another support. This low. Why this low? This low. I, drew this, I took out this low because I'm anticipating that the market should break and retest it. Why? Because this low produced a high that tapped into this resistance here. So this low is actually important. So if the market breaks this low, I want to sell from here, which that happened because the market pulled back and sold off. Then when it sold off, what? It came back to that level for the second time. So I will be waiting now for this low here. If the market comes here again the third time, I will look to sell. So if the market comes down to this level, I'm looking for a break and a retest. So this strategy is basically break and retest of horizontal levels. So now we can see here that this 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 level here has acted as resistance, has acted as resistance for more than four times. And now what we want to see is a break and a retest of the support level of this level. Okay? A break and a retest of this level which that happened this is it right here right there you see this you want to enter here this is where you enter your trade you sell your entry is here your stop loss is down to these lows guess how much you're gonna make like if you enter like one standard lot that's crazy then it came back again for the second time you can take it down again to those lows so like I said, this is what I do. This is how I trade. I don't use indicators. I use price action, break and resistance of support and resistance levels. I'm so patient with my trades because I have a huge watch list. And I actually use my laptop to analyze and use my phones at times when I'm not home. So this is a trade that I'm active in right now. Like I told you, I'm just waiting for the markets to reopen so I can close. So thanks for watching. See you in my next video.